you back out there. It's been so long for you. Just tell us your emotions. Yeah, I, my emotions were through the roof. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I was dang near crying at halftime because I saw a text from my mom because she wasn't here tonight. She was over doing my uh, cousin's bachelorette party, but she was just so proud of me. She said she was crying. I almost cried at halftime. So <laughs> it was just it was a great feeling to be back. You know, I love this team. I love Duke. It's awesome. Yeah, we'll rush through the, the, the long reception late in the first half. What did you see? What was going on there? Yeah, that was a play we ran over and over in practice. And as soon as I seen the coverage and the safety roll down, I knew I was getting the ball. It was a great call by Coach Brewer. And then Malik had the great vision to throw it to me. And yeah, it was a great play. So, uh, Are you getting it in the end zone next time? Yes, 100%. <laughs> <laughs> what were the emotions like for you leading up to this moment to get back out there? Yeah, honestly, I had a lot of nerves. I'm not going to lie. Like, my first catch, even, I didn't even tuck the ball right because I was, <laughs> I was like, you scared, like, what was going to happen? But, yeah, it was good. Once I got hit, I was comfortable. Got my, that, that catch helped a lot, too. So I fell back in the rhythm of things pretty quickly. Yeah. What's it like to go through that process of being injured, having to watch everybody else go through this thing from the sidelines and yeah. finally get back out there? Yeah, it's, I'm like, it's a terrible feeling. But it's like, it's a, you go through a physical injury, but the most, the hardest part is the mental game. And so I, that's why I tell the guys that get hurt now, like, you just got to stay the course, and your time's going to come. Like, you'll be stronger from it, and I got stronger from it. So, I, I love, like, I, t I don't take anything for granted. Every single practice, every single play, I try to go as hard as I can because I know it can be taken in an instant. Eli, we know you wanted to come back. Was there any point during the rehab that, that you had some doubts that you could do it? No, not not physically. Like, you know, I heard my, my left leg go up first, so, like, I knew I could come back physically. I just didn't know. Um, actually, no, it was, I had no doubts at all. I was ready to come back, <laughs> honestly, yeah. <laughs> I was ready to come back. What was it like for you guys in terms of you've gone through camp with Coach Diaz and, and, and a new staff? This is the first time on a game night. To do yeah. That. I mean, uh, yeah, honestly, it felt just like we had a couple of scrimmages. It felt just like a scrimmage. Like everything, they, they've got us ready, game ready from the start. Uh, coaches are the same every single day. They bring the same energy, the same intensity. So it was really easy to go out there and just perform like we do every single day. Did you have to ask for the third and goal call to, to you? Or <laughs> no, I, did, I didn't ask for it. It was a great call, Coach Brewer. I, I, I appreciate him. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> That's love. No, I didn't ask for it. You've been here six years. What does it mean for you to see like all the changes around the program yeah. to get to know? It feels really good. I feel like we're like, we're, for the guys I came in with, I feel like it's kind of a, an honor to them because they were here when things weren't looking so hot. And so for me to still be here and trying to, you know, push on, it's, that's the class 2019 right there. I'm showing out for them, and, you know, <laughs> all those guys. Yeah. Do you remember? Yeah, it was in the bowl game, and uh, I, I just caught it and pretty much went down. I didn't have any yak or anything, so it was good to get that one out there. <laughs> Coach, right. just tell us about, um, you know, there were so many long deep balls tonight. They were just off. Mm -hmm. Do you guys notice that? You, he said, you, once you guys watch the film, you're going to realize how close this offense was to really having a huge night. Yeah, you see the excellence right there. We, we chase excellence. We don't, we don't chase the success. So, like, we weren't successful with those plays, but like they were open. We were doing the right thing. Everybody's doing their job. We're going to make those plays. They're going to come. For us to be open and to see that, we make them all the time in practice. I'm confident we're going to make them in the game, so we'll be all right.